Everybody, welcome back to the shop. Try to squeeze in a little video before my battery goes dead. Alright guys, I got my plane kind of set up in my parting plane. See how I cut this wood out bigger? I just want to kind of, I got to get me some kind of frame built. I got to hold it in there. And first of all, I got to get it in the right position. Alright. So I'm taking some of my masonite. And putting my back wall on. Yeah, this is how we mold now, baby. So I've been to a pro shop. We're all going to learn from that trip. Okay. Bam. That's all I want to get in there for now. So I can get in here and trim. I just wanted to hold these two backboards and keep them from flopping. Back and forth. You know what I mean? I also kind of need a board right here. To hold this fuselage. We don't want it. I kind of want that bad boy right there. Put me a little piece of clay right there. Put that board right there. And then hold that dude in position. Get as thin as I can see so I can. Yeah. So I can still get behind it to uh, clay. I don't want this model moving. My plug. Once I start claying. Uh, and I don't trust this hot glue on plastic. So you kind of see where I glued that across there. Okay, a little clay right there. And it should pretty much hold it where I want. Start putting some clay in this crack. Gotta be careful there too, not to let that plastic move too much. So remember, that's just thin plastic right there. And I'm basically gonna pack this clay all the way around it. See what this, it's easy to clay this. It's one good thing about it. We just got to be careful and not push our styrene plastic way out of flatness. We want that to stay pretty flat and just let me be careful. Push on both sides at the same time. We just want that clay to ooze through there a little bit. So I can come back with a razor knife and trim it off. This ain't quite in the center. Oh yeah, this is just pushed out a little bit.
Once I get this fish slush molded, guys, I'm pretty much done molding. I gotta mold up the other halves to my uh, elevators, but uh, that ain't no big deal. And my carbon fiber, my 1K carbon fiber ought to be here this week. So, I'm gonna get my first one laid up and throw a 049 on the nose. Get a lot of people saying, I'd go electric, I'd go electric. Yeah, guys, you know, you can put electric on yours. <laughs> this is going to be set up to where you can put anything you want in it. I just want, I don't want to charge batteries all the time. I want to be able to land it, fill it up with fuel, go again. And uh, they're probably going to come out a lot lighter. Oh four nine. You know how it is. By the time you get a big old battery in something, and motor and all that stuff, it's gonna gain a little weight anyway. So I just want an 049 on my first one. I won't have to go buy nothing. I got everything here, man. Tell you what, it's a lot easier to play this thin plastic. This ain't no problem at all. Put it all in from the back side and just trim it off. Keeps any resin from oozing through. It gives me a really nice porting plane. Played up. I'll put the rest of my sides on. I already got them all trimmed and ready to go. That'll be my box. Just gonna pack a little extra clay here and there to help stabilize this piece in there because once it's clayed up you do not want this piece moving. You guys want to practice molding something? This is the perfect little thing. 
Remember, Associated Industry sells small amounts of stuff. You can find a link on our website. Tell them Bob sent you. I'm going to get my finger in there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Well, we just turn that clay up. I'll get this played up. I don't want to mess with it too much. I need to get some 
Poured all sprayed on you and some resin. I really, really, really want my scene to come out good. And it depends an awful lot on my clay job. The clay job is important and determines how your mold comes out, the edge of your mold, you know. There, man. I see one spot I need to get. There ain't no clay here at all. Okay, bam. I still got a little bit to go on the bottom. See, it's nice clayed up. Now I'm going to put me some dots up here in these corners. Put my sides on. This thing is ready to lay up. And mold up. But my battery light's flashing. So, I'll make another video when I get to that part. We'll see you guys back in the shop.